I'm Sarah Hashimaris for the Los Angeles Times. Philadelphia abortion doctor Kermit Gosnell was found guilty this week of first degree murder in connection to the deaths of three babies, a charge that could lead to the death penalty. The babies were delivered alive and killed with scissors at what prosecutors have dubbed a house of horrors clinic. The jury reached its verdict after 10 days of deliberations. The Times reports that 72-year-old Gosnell was also found guilty of involuntary manslaughter in the overdose death of an abortion patient and was cleared in the death of a fourth infant. The case has taken center stage in the nation's abortion debate, with both sides endorsing the verdict. During the trial, Gosnell was portrayed as an advocate for impoverished West Philadelphia women. However, the Times reports that former clinic employees testified the doctor routinely performed abortions past Pennsylvania's 24-week limit, adding that the, the doctor delivered babies who were still moving or breathing, and he and his assistants killed the newborns by snipping their spines. The jury will return May 21st to hear further evidence and to deliberate on whether Gosnell should get the death penalty. Stay with us for more details on this story at LATimes.com and on Twitter at LATimes.